Hi, my name is Rudy. I am an out queer athlete and I am a believer in the ally effect. Uh, I'm a distance runner and I played rugby for four years at the College of New Jersey and as someone who has had the support of amazing straight allies and also as an ally myself, both as a feminist ally to women and as a white anti-racist ally, I know how important allies are, whether it's in the classroom, the workplace, on the field, or even part of a political movement. Uh, being a collegiate athlete has shaped who I am physically, intellectually, and as well as, as a community leader, and I could not have had the experience that I did without some amazing straight allies for teammates. And I want to share my story, especially with straight athletes, to make a case for why you should make a point of being an ally to LGBT athletes. First, a little perspective on being a queer athlete, especially as a guy. No male athlete in any of America's major league sports has ever come out while still actively playing, so a lot of young LGBT athletes are still under the impression that there is no room for us and that athletics are for straight people who conform to gender norms. And my experience of playing at the collegiate level showed that this could not be further from the truth, which was really great for me. I broke a lot of stereotypes of what a rugby player could be, of what a queer person can be, and my teammates did me an equal service in breaking stereotypes of what straight male athletes can be. Um, it was clear from the moment I walked onto the pitch that I was not straight, that I was not traditionally masculine, but I did not make a point of coming out, and nobody made a point of telling me that it was safe to or coming out as a straight ally. So for a while I had a pretty okay experience but ended up hearing some unfortunate homophobic language on the field being used really casually. And as I got used to the team dynamics and playing with them and also getting elected to be the treasurer for the team, I realized that I was being given a lot of respect by my teammates and it wasn't based on my identity, it was based entirely on merit. And if they respected me enough to elect me as a team leader, then I had had, you know, decided that I had to have enough respect for them to be completely honest with who I was and trust that they would deal with that gracefully. And the fact is they rose to the occasion. My closest teammates immediately became my greatest allies on the field, calling out younger players, making it really clear that there was no place on our rugby pitch for homophobic language or bullying. And being an athlete ally not only means making a positive effect, you know, on the lives of and experiences of your LGBT teammates, as my teammates did for me, but it actually means improving your team as a whole and improving your personal experience as an athlete on that team. The reality is every team wants to win. To do so, you want as many people as possible to be able to come out and try out to play for your team. And in this day and age, nobody would consider discriminating based on race, ethnicity, or religion. So realistically, uh, gender expression and sexuality should also not be a consideration of having an athlete on a team. The only question that should matter is, will this person help our team win? and will they demonstrate excellent sportsmanship in doing so. And especially if you're a college athlete watching this, you should know, you already do know actually, that college is an amazing time to have more diverse experiences than maybe you've previously had in your life. And being on a team with someone who's had different life experiences than you, whether or not those are related to sexuality, and working with that person towards a common goal um, you know, that makes you a more well-rounded person. It'll make you a more effective leader in your future. And I know that coming out as an ally can seem almost as scary as coming out as gay, but it will make you stronger, it will make your team stronger in the long run. And know that you are not alone in coming out as an ally. There's a lot of support from for how to do this. Um, you know, check out what professionals like Ben Cohen and Brendan uh, Einbadejo have said about being an ally to LGBT people. Um, also check out Hudson Taylor's webpage about being an athlete ally and his YouTube page because he has a lot of really practical advice on how to do that. So my advice is read up, learn how to do it, and come out now as an LGBT athlete ally because for you and for your team there is nothing to lose and a lot of really positive benefits that I promise will come out of that.